All right, you guys know how overwhelmed these Black Friday sales are making me. Mostly because... It's every single store and they started like two weeks early and the sales have been going on and off and changing and as somebody who tracks the sales for you guys, I'm like, I gotta take a break. I don't even know what to do. So for today's video, I've compiled all of my favorite Black Friday sales that are currently going on. These are subject to change. They're changing daily and because I'm filming this Wednesday, I'm sure by tomorrow, some of these sales will be different, additional, whatever. Point being, I have a list, it will be in the description box, of all my favorite stores to shop at and a link to the website. <laughs> and I'm gonna go over in the video today what some of those sales are. I already did a Black Friday sales video last week. I will link that down below, but a lot more sales have been added. Some things are different. I'm not gonna talk about everything on the list. It's long, but I'm gonna talk about, talk about my favorites. So if you're interested in that, then just keep watching. So the point is that this is the guide for you. I'm going to be keeping the description box updated for you guys with as much sale info as I can. Let's go down the list. Let me show you this. So I've put together a Google Doc. This is how I'm keeping myself organized of all these sales, okay? I'm not gonna go over all of these today because that would be a bit extra and this video would be two hours long and let's be honest, you can easily just click on the links and see for yourself. But I did wanna talk about some sales that I know you guys would be interested in. I've been doing this for four years now. I feel like for the most part, I've got you guys figured out. I know what we're interested in. So these are my favorites that I'm gonna talk about, but all of the ones that I like are here. There's probably a lot more. Just think of a store that you like to shop at. Go to that website and I'm sure there will be discounts. But along the top here, I have the bigger stores that carry multiple brands, right? So we have, okay, self-plug here, okay? What is it? Plugging myself. <laughs> I don't know what that's called. Self-promo here. Muse Beauty Pros having their holiday shop. I've done a whole video on that, but if you want to get Viseart, buy Viseart for this sale. They have the best deals. Also, check out Viseart's website, though. They have upwards of 50% off. I actually wasn't going to talk about that, but do look at Viseart's website. Love this from Esam. Okay, the main attraction here, right? Right? Morgan Turner x Esam Rush Collection. <laughs> She's in my hands right now. Also, $168 is a lot, okay? Please do not feel obligated to buy this just because I came out with it. If it's not within your budget, completely understandable. I get it. Uh, the price is so high because I have three very big natural hair brushes for the face. And you guys know those are quite pricey. That did, did unfortunately drive the price of the bundle up. But I also wasn't going to sell myself short on a set. If I was going to put my name on something, I was going to include all of my favorite brushes that I think enhance a makeup routine. So this is my set of brushes that I love, but I did forget to address this in my original video. If it's out of your budget, I just appreciate your support of liking my videos, commenting, everything that you're doing now. I truly appreciate it. This is just a bonus if it's something that you feel like you need. But anyways... It would make a great gift, and it's a great starter set for brushes. They are pro quality, not going to break. Okay, so promo's over. Check out this Muse Beauty Pro sale. I've already covered it. I've already done a whole video. It's worth checking out. That's great. This, I believe, is going to run for a while. Yes, it ends December 26th, so no huge rush compared to what we have going on. But there's that. Sephora, I'm not even going to show it. I haven't been... This should be 25. I haven't been too moved by the Sephora stuff. Like, you know, I saw the Mercury Retrograde was 50% off. There's been a few individual items that are really good. But for the most part, for Black Friday sales, go directly to the brand's website. So those are where you're going to find the best deals. You will have the one-off items on Ulta and Sephora where they will be 50% off, like the Huda Beauty Mercury Retrograde, for example. Maybe a Tom Ford palette. Things like that on Sephora and Ulta. 
take a peek, but to me, they really aren't the main attractions. I know Sephora today is 25% off Fenty and Beauty Blender. I believe Fenty should have a 25% off sale. Um, I'm taking a look at Ulta. I've honestly been quite disappointed with the Ulta sales that I've seen. They had a really good sale like two weeks ago, and it's gone now. But again, take a look on the website each day. See if there's something that you need. I see 30% off ABH brows. I don't know. It's worth taking a look at if there's some stuff that you've been needing, honestly, but it's not my favorite sales. That goes for both Sephora and Ulta. I also have Nordstrom linked here. Not necessarily makeup. I think the makeup on sale is not very good, but... You know, they have some nice workout clothes, home stuff. You can take a peek for yourself, but Nordstrom has some deals of upwards of 40% off. I'm a big Nordstrom girl, so I wanted to link that for you guys. Durham Store is the last of our really big stores that we have. Use code BLACK at checkout. Uh, there's a huge list of up to 30% off items. Really, really great deals. I'm not going to go over this because they literally have 122 pages of products that you can choose from. Derm Store has some fabulous makeup brands and skincare. Derm Store, I believe, is one of the best places to get some really good, clean skincare products like. Embryolise, I'm looking at this right now. I use this in my makeup kit, incredible. So Durham Store has a lot of those professional brands that are a little bit harder to get a hold of as well. Um, oh, this looks cool, a micro, okay, let me get off this, but Durham Store is another great one if you're looking to collect multiple items from different brands. Underrated company in my opinion. Okay, you guys know about the Pat McGrath sales. I just have the link down below for your convenience. Hoping that they will have the $12 lip sale. I would definitely keep you updated if that's the case. Y'all have lipstick going to No. I will definitely keep you updated if that is the case. As of today, not yet. Refer, 50% off site wide. You can't go wrong with their brushes. You cannot go wrong with their modular vanity set. This is an older sale that I've already talked about, but amazing. Okay. Here's a newer one that I'm excited about that I haven't talked about. Hourglass is 20% off. So if you're watching this and you don't see it on the website, you're probably too early. If you're early, the early access code at checkout is BFVIP. So Black Friday VIP 2021, and that will give you 20% off on checkout. Hourglass, super expensive, but really great products. If there's anything you need to stock up on, stock on, stock up on them. <laughs> I'm wearing the Hourglass Foundation right now. If you like the Hourglass Foundation, take a look at this. Yeah, I'm not going to talk too much about what to get. It's whatever you feel you need, but 20% off is awesome. The best sale, and I'm looking at all my typos, the best sale, in my opinion, of this whole Black Friday, but you had to get lucky, was the Huda Beauty up to 80% off. Now, not everything was 80% off, obviously, but the newer products that haven't been on sale yet, the Huda Beauty Glowish line, as you can see, is 30% off. That's a way bigger deal than what you can get off at Sephora, so this is the cheapest price that these newest items are are gonna be at. I mean, this thing is pages, pages long. I picked up a perfume and I stocked up on eyelashes, y'all. This is my favorite sale. I think they have some of the best values here. Of course, it is a lot of the older items that are going to be 80% off, the ones that they're trying to get rid of. But do you guys see this? $3 lashes. Now, if you didn't shop this sale right away when it started, a lot of the good stuff has sold out, unfortunately. Uh, but you can see 460 for this fair lash that looks beautiful. Lashes were what I got. Lashes were what excited me. And you missed out probably on the $13 Desert Dusk Palette. I bought that. I don't need a Desert Dusk Palette. But for $13, all of a sudden I did. 70% off the Rose Gold Remastered. I actually didn't have this. My mom had it. So I bought this for $20. Worth taking a look at. I bought a bunch of Olivia's and of course they're not there anymore. The good stuff is sold out. It's late at this point, but definitely, I mean, you see these deals. They're nuts. So this is my favorite Black Friday sale. I know you guys wanted my opinion on the Natasha Denona Black Friday sale. I've got to be honest with you guys, I'm a little underwhelmed. I don't like, like, it's a good value. If you need to grow your Natasha Denona collection, 
this is a good time to do it but a lot of them are in bundles and if you have a large collection you might have a palette or two in the bundles which makes it a little bit more difficult good deals though so if you want to build it now is the time circle loco zendo palette they're odd pairings that's the only thing i'm not feeling is these odd groupings of palettes but to build really great deals Zendo is like in every single one of them because Zendo is not very good in my humble opinion. The Love palette, I believe they're having trouble selling. The best bundle to get in terms of value and the quality that you're getting, if you want the 28 pan palettes, you need to get this bundle. $239. I know. Are you nuts enough to spend that much money on a palette? These are the best palettes ever. Period. The best quality ever from Natasha Denona are in these two palettes. They have the most beautiful colors. I'm not saying you need to spend $239 on an eyeshadow palette, but you get two. So it's almost like 50% off, right? Or this is 50% off. So you're basically getting one for free. And if you're an eyeshadow enthusiast and this is something that you wanted, this is a time to get it. If you had your eye on the 28 pan palettes, this is a, the time to get it, and I cannot stress enough how good the quality on these are. I also think that this duo is really nice. These are two underrated palettes from Natasha, in my opinion, Circle Loco and Trio Chrome. Humble opinion, good value, because I know a lot of you passed on these because there probably weren't colors that you would wear as often. This is a good deal. So if you see palettes that you like in the bundles, good deal. But again, the palettes on sale really aren't moving me. I think the $85 Biba is something you might want to consider if you're into neutrals. This one is a good one. Uh, purple Blue is $145. I don't have the Sunset palette. That one is in my mom's collection, and I considered getting this because it was $65. Ultimately, I decided not to because I really don't care for this color story. Leela, I think, was a palette way before its time. I think now these colors are more popular. Circle Loco, $78. Yeah, I mean, if there's a palette that you want, really good deals on these. For me, I just wish she had some other palettes on sale, personally. So what else we got Black Friday? Face palettes also are on sale. Again, you can take the plunge and get all of the palettes at once. It's going to hurt the wallet, but these are quite good deals. In my opinion, my favorite is the Bloom palette. This is the OG, $36. It's a fabulous deal on this. I also use the Tam palette a lot. I didn't love it at first, but I really like some of the formulations in here. These are actually pretty good. $25 for these two, that's awesome. Lips is where Natasha Denona is also strong in. Hmm. I didn't even know Natasha Denona had eyelashes. Anyways, this is one of my all-time favorite lipstick formulas, so these are a good deal to me. The Lipophoria is not really worth it, not that good of a price in my opinion. Love the lip crayons. They're not a huge discount, but they're nice. Uh, but the lipsticks, individually, not as good of a deal. Better deal if you buy them in the bundles, but I do recommend the lipsticks. Let's see, what else do we have here? Okay, so these are just the bundles that we saw. Yeah, I mean, maybe it's different for me because I own everything from Natasha Denona, so it's not as exciting for me. But I'm getting similar vibes from Charlotte Tilbury in that I feel like these are just items she couldn't sell. It's not that exciting. The only thing that really is making me giddy for you guys is the 28 pm palettes. Also really great, NARS is 20 to 30% off site-wide. This is one that excites me because NARS is pricey and I love NARS so much. I think that they're underrated. So if you spend $150, you get 30% off. Otherwise, it's 20% off. I think that's a fabulous deal. NARS doesn't really go on sale. They're one of those brands where this is truly a special time. So if you need anything from NARS, now is the time, okay? I love NARS. I think they have great base products. I th Honestly, everything that NARS does is really great. Some of the limited edition items can be a little bit hit or miss. Just do your research. This one is a good deal, and you don't come by a deal like this from NARS very often, so that's kind of what I want to bring your attention to. I did do a sponsored video with MAC. They are having 30% off site-wide if you need to pick up anything from MAC. Even though MAC does not excite me as a brand, 
I don't really talk about them too much on my channel. I do use a lot of their products regularly in my makeup routine and in my makeup kit because at the end of the day, they really do have some great staple products. So if there was anything you were thinking that you needed to pick up, now is the time to do that. Miss BK Beauty. Oh, I seriously, if you haven't supported BK Beauty yet, you need to. Miss Lisa J over here is just a diamond of a human being. Um, so I guess it depends what you pick up. But there are these big savings. I know that Angie Hot and Flashy set just restocked. And BK Beauty also launched a travel version of their brushes. I'm trying to see if it's on here. Yes. So if you wanted a travel set, this is really cute. This just launched as well. And her lipsticks are new. Her lipsticks are bomb. If you have a lot of lines on your lips, these make them look luscious and plump. I'm just saying. Now it's the time to get BK Beauty if you were interested. I mean, she has probably my favorite synthetic brushes. They really do feel like natural hair to me. And yep, there's a little bit of a discount on the brushes. So that's that's awesome. Okay, so now I have a lot of like other brands. Kosas is 30% off if you spend $75. And that's a really low minimum for such a big percentage off. I'm actually wearing a number of Kosas products. At first the Kosas sale I was lukewarm about, but then I thought about it. Pretty much everything that Kosas comes out with is phenomenal. They have the cloud set powders. They have the concealer, which is nice. Today I used the powder. I use the eyebrow products, one of my all-time favorite eyebrow products. Their cream blushes are phenomenal. The bronzer is phenomenal. Their lip glosses are supposed to be super good. So anyways, now might be the time to stock up on Kosas. 30% off, bomb. Kopari is one of my favorite body brands. They are 25% off site-wide. I really love their body scrubs. I'm trying to see if I can find it. I also use their deodorant as well. Their deodorant is a little bit too watery. If you're sweaty, you won't like it. But if you're not a sweaty person, then you will like their deodorant. But anyways, their exfoliating crush scrub, the coconut crush scrub, all-time favorite body exfoliator. So good deal, good deal. Really like that from Gopari. Okay, Tatcha. I know Tatcha is an expensive brand, 20% off with the code CYBER21. If there's any skincare you need to pick up, if you need to pick up your primer, now's the time to do that. This is one that excited me. I've been a long time user of T3. I don't have too many hair tools from them. I've had a straightener in my lifetime from them and I have a blow dryer that I use from them. They last forever. I had my straightener for 10 years before I decided to retire it just because I felt like I had it too long, but it still worked perfectly fine. T3 products are amazing. They have 25% off site weight. I love my hair dryer from them. So if you're looking for tools that are literally going to last a lifetime, now is the time to do that. This is where the discount really matters with pricey items like these. I so very much want to get a curling iron from them. And one of the hairstylists that I work with for bridal, she loves and swears by T3, buys them every couple of years for her hair kit. They really do have the best heated hair products. So this is something that I did wanna to bring to your attention just because really great deal. Briogeo for hair, another hair brand, 25% off site wide. I currently am using their curl cream, which is nice. It's probably not my favorite, but I know a lot of you use their shampoos and conditioners, so this one is a really good one. Benefit and Too Faced are both 30% off site wide. Code FRYE for Benefit and Thanks30 for Too Faced. If you need to pick up anything from those two brands, 30% off is pretty much as good of a price as you're going to get, especially for their permanent line items. Maybe not the limited edition. Those normally go off on like 50% off. Uh, but any of those staples, now's a good time. BH Cosmetics, you guys know they're my favorite affordable brand of makeup products. Up to 70% off. Some of the deals that they have are nuts, you guys. Look at this. $3.60 for a blush palette. Like these are some cheap good quality gifts that you can give to people and the quality is legitimately nice. The Lit List, this is the new eyeshadow palette for $20. $3.60 for this palette. Now, 
I'm not, oh, $6.80 for this gorgeous Passion in Paris palette. Yeah, definitely take a look if you are into BH Cosmetics palettes like myself because literally some of these are dirt cheap. I said it, completely dirt cheap. Summer in Saint-Tropez is probably my all-time favorite, $6.80 from BH. Blueberry Muffin, incredible colors, incredible quality. From what I've heard, I have it and I haven't used it yet, but $7.20. Uh, yeah, take a look. That's a really worthwhile Black Friday sale to look into. Nest Candles. I was just talking about in my Sephora haul how I love Nest Candles. They're quite pricey, but Nest Candles are very luxurious in my opinion, but they are amazing. So 25% off your order. I think that's a really fabulous deal. Who is not going to love a Nest candle? Honestly, they're so pretty. They can be used as decor. This is like a nice quality gift to give to somebody or to get for yourself. They have a lot of different sets, I believe. Do they have sets? Did I just lie to you? I might have just lied to you, but I like their candles. So I was happy to see this sale. <laughs> okay, it was Velispa has the sets, not Nest. Okay, so the rest of these are older ones that I talked about last week for the most part, but just to quickly cover them. ABH's sale actually changed. It's not as good anymore. It's just 30% off site wide, but if you need something, go get it. But it really isn't as good as it used to be. So unfortunately, the good, good sale is over. Sigma Beauty is still 40% off site wide. Charlotte Tilbury is still not my favorite holiday sets, but they did add some new ones. Cover FX up to 50% off. Beauty Bay is something that did catch my eye because the Beauty Bay brand is actually 40% off. And I know Karen Harris loves their eyeshadow palettes. Now there's lots of other brands like Mari Badascu 30, The Ordinary 10, Nabla 30, Wet n Wild 30. So number of different deals at Beauty Bay to look into. I guess this is one of those larger retailers that I put should have put towards the top. But I am staring hard at these eyeshadow palettes. I know Karen likes them. Let me know what you guys think. Are the Beauty Bay palettes worth it? Because these colors, oh my gosh, I love a big, this is $10? Honey, okay. I don't need any eyeshadow palettes, but I, I've been eyeing them and they look like palettes I can't refuse. Anyways, 20% off Kaleidos. Love me some Kaleidos. Really beautiful eyeshadow palettes and I love their eyeshadow primer, Urban Decay. Um, it says up to 30% off, but there's a few items that they have for 50% off. I believe some of the Naked palettes are 50% off. Yawn. They have some sets. Yeah. Remember when these were the Christmas gift? Like when the Naked palettes, everybody got one for Christmas because they wanted it so bad. I covered this already. ColourPop is 30% off. They also just came out with, well, they always come out with new products, but yes. New Vaults are 30% off. Lots of good stuff. Collabs, this one is really good. 50% off on ColourPop. Like the really good ones. The Child Palette is $8. Nightmare Before Christmas is all 50% off. So really great collabs. So if you see something that somebody you love you know would enjoy you can get this whole lip and eye set for $32 those are steals of deals for gifts because they're so affordable and they're so cute and fun Terra Moons their sale has started I have a swatch and sip coming with their newest collection I just haven't had time to finish editing it but it will be up probably this weekend so they have discounts on their different shadows for the last few years I've shopped the Terra Moon's Black Friday sale. I think this is the first year that I'm going to sit it out just because I've collected a large amount at this point. So I'm trying to enjoy those shadows as opposed to add more for once in my life. This is my favorite indie brand in terms of value. I think that indie brand shadows can get very expensive for good reason, but the value on the Terra Moon's is my favorite. They're a good price. Uh, Kyer Weiss. I'm not a huge fan of Kyer Weiss from what I've tried, but they are 20% off if you are interested. Ilia will be 20% off. They, they are not 20% off now. It starts on the 26th, but okay. And also on the 26th, 
Odin's Eye will be having 40% off site-wide. I will have a video tomorrow because I am wearing Odin's Eyes on my eye right now where I talk a little bit more about my favorite palettes. But just know it's there for you, for your convenience. And that's, that's that. Those are the Black Friday deals that I have to share with you guys. It was a lot. It is a lot. And I hope you aren't getting too stressed. Remember, don't be too selfish. Look for presents for others. I'm speaking to myself when I say that because... I need to look for presents for others, but I'm getting I'm getting sucked in by these Black Friday sales for myself. But honestly, if you are shopping on a budget, there are some really great options here, particularly ColourPop, Huda Beauty, BH Cosmetics. Those have some of the best deals that I've seen in terms of good quality gifts for a dirt cheap price. But there we have it. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Happy shopping. I will keep updating the description box to the best of my ability with all of the updated deals. These are affiliate links, so that does mean I make a commission if you do click on the links and shop through that link. So don't feel obligated to do so. Just be aware that that's what happens. And yeah, thank you guys so much for being subscribed to my channel and liking this video. If you aren't subscribed to my channel already, I would love it if you would consider taking the time to do so. And I will see you all in the next one. Bye guys, have a good one.